Hey guys, welcome to episode number three. One, two, three. Yup, yup. Anyways, uh, as you can see, I'm expanding my chest room or expanding my base right now, and I found something really special. Uh, I was while I was digging around, I heard some uh, skeletons, some zombies, and some spiders. So I started to dig up and down, and this is what I found: a spawner. And as you can see, it's right at the level of my base. I'm gonna. F I did try to see what's in in here, but I couldn't see anything. I'm trying to have a look. It's kind of hard when you don't see anything in there, you know. I don't want to go in there and get killed by these. Uh eh, what is this? Oh, hi. Okay. That was a, a bat. Okay, but I'm sure that there's something else in there, so I can hear s other stuff. Let's try to see if I can add another torch in there. No, I can't. So I might be able to dig on both sides. Looks wide enough. Uh, I'm gonna pl put this here. I'm gonna try to dig one, one higher. Oh, oh, oh! Hello, hello, hello! No, 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 no. Hey, how did you get down, down here, bud? No, 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 no. I don't want to die. Woo, okay. That was... That was scary. I thought... <laughs> that's fun. Ah, ah, no, no. You know you're not coming. Ah, jeez. Are you free? Are you serious? Okay, good. okay, well, guys, I think I found a something really strong here. I might have to try to do something to get these guys under control. And I heard a, a TNT too, so a oh, TNT, a creeper explode. Looks like I will have a great job to dig this out. Can I put some there? Come on, ah, come on, come on. Yay, okay. That's that. Perfect, man. Perfect. Okay. Looks like I have a grinder here. Perfect for me. And I'll be able to fix my tools, like my uh, my pick and my sword. Woohoo! Yay! Yeah! Okay, let's see now what I'm going to have. How I'm going to fix this so I can have a proper fix working grinder eh. all right see you later guys well guys as a bit before i was starting to dig out a bit more and now look <clears throat> sorry for that i kind of found a nice little spawner i started digging around because in, in here it was kind of dangerous oh by the way yes i did claim it so yep I have two spawners at about the same height. Oh, oh, they're at the same height. Okay, anyways. So now I'm going to try to fix this. Make it workable. Make all of these. What are they? Or, uh, skeletons, I think. Yeah, okay. They're skeletons. Jeez. I was kind of wondering what they were. Anyways, so I'm going to make them fall in here. Go up there, do go into a water elevator, all the way up there, go all the way up here, and fall back into this nice little section where I'm gonna be sitting here, having fun with my sword and slashing them up. Now the only thing that I need to do is to prepare the waterways for them to travel to, and that's gonna be it. I was kind of digging more and more to be a, to be able to uh, expand my uh, chess room or at least the start of my chess room and disappear in my face. Well guys, I'm happy to to have it. Now I'm going to be able to fix my uh, pickaxe and I have a second pickaxe here that I needed to have some a um uh silk touch on it. So I'm going to have I'm going to need a lot of experience 
and I'm gonna ha need a lot of book because I don't have one book in here or in here or even uh, where is it I had a book earlier but I think somebody took it or I might have misplaced it it's mostly that I misplaced it though okay anyways I don't have a, I don't have a uh, the uh, silk touch book so I'm gonna spend a lot of experience a lot of uh, of um, I was going to say diorite uh, uh, lapis lazuli to make my second pickaxe as powerful as possible to dig out some ice so this is going to be nice for ice and I'm going to have a anyways it, it, it's going to work out oh and uh, my video just came out today uh, well, while I'm filming this part here I want you guys to tell me what color of sheep I should do my big head sheep of there and I still need some brown dyes yeah I, I'm, I'm missing only one color for my uh, sheep so I'm gonna finish that down there I'm gonna start using it because I need experience and after that well I show you how it works so see you in a few I hope all right all right all right all right all right let's do this again <laughs> All right, all right, guys. I finished the darn little grinder that I wanted to do. I just need to make it look better inside my base. And yes, I do have skeletons coming down. I would show you what I did up there, but the problem is, it's like ugh. It. I almost died like three times. I have no deaths yet, so I'm okay. I'm getting good resources. I even I'm even getting a uh, good diamond uh, uh, gold armor, so I can smelt it up right after. And the only thing that I'm missing here is the small machine to get my experience. I'll do that later. So this has been this is done. Now what I need to be building is the entrance to the theme park let me go up there and I'll meet you up there the sheep farm is getting good I, I have creepers near my base again let's try to shoot them out of existence hello you die you you creeper there we go so yeah uh, the sheep farm is getting good I'm still missing these guys are escape artists, man. Oh, anyways. I'm getting some good quality of wool in each one of these. I should add these now. So I have this one here to, that I can up, put up there so I can know which color is, is in which. Instead of, uh, of looking each time. Anyways, just just to show you that, that, they were, that they're working. So I'm pretty proud of it. And this is the start of the theme park. I did that a few days ago. I was sick for two days because of my uh, health problems. Uh, these aren't the colors that I'd be... Uh, well, they might be the colors, but they might be not be the colors too. Because I need something more flashy. It's a theme park, guys. Uh, so I have all of the ships uh, making me more wall. Uh, in the middle here, I'm gonna put some f uh, fence posts so people will have to come in here, pay for a ticket, and go and play. So I might go online to get some ideals. I'm out. I'm freshly out of ideals since uh, a few days already, <laughs> but. I'll be making a few lanes here, a few shops that people will be able to come. I'll even put a uh, nice little portal right here or a bit more further out so people can just jump in, go in, pay, and have fun. Um, and that's about it for now. So if anybody knows where I can find a some nice uh, cocoa beans, and hoping that I don't, I'm not losing all of my sheep up there. 
let me know in chat. It could be you guys, could be my colleagues online. I'll be happy to take everything that I can. I need only one cocoa bean and one uh, jungle tree. So let's see this. In my next clip, I'll be having a a new mob uh, mod installed called time uh, not time lapse. Uh, anyways, it's something that that will create a time lapse of me building most of it and making the walls to begin with and starting on something new at least i hope that it's gonna work <laughs> all right so here's a small time lapse i hope well guys here i am i did do a few changes on my build i built this creepy <laughs> big eye let me think in the, this, uh, in the comments if you like it or not. I wanted something creepy at the same time and colorful. So this is called a bit of both. Uh, I changed the black dyes, uh, the black dyes, the, ba the black wool, sorry for that, for a white one. So it makes it a bit more colorful. Colorful. Uh, I'm going to add some, I don't know, I might be adding some pillagers in here or some villagers as soon as I build my own uh, little uh, villager breather and that's what uh, yeah and when the doors are, are going to be closed as soon as i switch this like this or to close this is going to pop up and nobody is going to be able to pass so that's about it for that okay i didn't do a time lapse because i'm i had too much fun building that i forgot to uh, <laughs> install my uh, replay mod uh, but hey that's life but this is built now I just need to do uh, something around here if possible uh, it had taken me a few days to build this this because I've been busy trying to find myself for another job to fill out what I know well I'm not working a uh, full time anymore and I, w and I do like to have a full-time job so I have to look for a job but don't worry guys I'm not in trouble yet so all good for that uh, yeah I know that at the bottom here it's wider than on top don't, but don't forget guys eyes aren't equal to each other except in Minecraft alright so I'm gonna go to bed and I'm gonna come back and when I said uh, that I was get, uh, getting distracted I'm gonna show you by what Give me a few seconds here. There you go. So I've been digging down here to expand my nice little chest rooms. Yeah, I've been killing uh, skeletons, digging out things, helping out people on the server once in a while, adding uh, some new uh, texture packs. And some new, um, how you call that again? Give me a few seconds here. I'm going to go on to Mr. Eczema Void's uh, texture packs. Uh, vanilla Tweaks. There you go. I got it. Sorry for that. I got it. Uh, vanilla Tweaks. So there's a few things that, that are going to be changed. And we're going to have some more fun doing more stuff and using less resources and with some of them oh, there we go that's what i wanted anyway so yeah th this is what i was going i was building in the past uh i was coming down here i forgot to i forgot why what the okay let me think about it <laughs> i'll come back okay uh what i wanted were these uh, armor stands yep why because what I did with them oh, 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 oh yeah and by the way one day later again uh, <laughs> I did some decoration here I added some cutters I added a kind of a uh, yellow and red small like ray and with these armor stands was going to do this my ticket givers I have a penguin here I have a these annoying guys coming in and coming out of existence 
<coughs> sorry and i added this one here uh this is made with the book the statue data pack so you right click it you decide you see which one that you want and how to add them properly on a block like this number one you put a understand down and i and in this game we have a um, understand editor and we have the armor stand book at the same time so with the with the armor store the, the uh, with this one here i do this put that right there then go on to my book uh position alignment and i, I just press on this one here and there you go it's positioned and it hides everything so on the hermit they did this and now well, okay so now he's keeping my uh, my wall okay anyways so that's one way to do it uh visibility let's put him back let's put him back to visible so so that we can destroy him Ta -da! okay let me go to sleep be right back wake up time okay so yeah i added these guys see this one here i would like him to face that one instead but it's all good uh i didn't put any armors on this one yet because i didn't have any these are all closed wickets and now i have a pillager because i had a few of these guys uh, near me and i have a uh, cookie guy <laughs> I'm trying to be smart here. Uh, uh, a ginger, a gingerbread guy. Whoa, that was a that was a close one. I got it. Okay, so <laughs> this is all done. Uh, the entrance is from there to there right now because I'm gonna expand it that way on towards the, the the north and towards the south, and I'm gonna build start building all of my theme park excitement in here. So to begin with, I'm gonna start. Well, I'm going to add a few more uh, fences to at least end up up to here so people don't jump in line. And as soon as I'm going to close these doors, that's going to pop up at the same time so they won't be able to go out from here and open a door for somebody else. Yeah, I know, guys, if the player just have to do this, oh, just have to do this and go in. I know, I know, I know. Don't worry about it. Get <clears throat> don't worry about that that i do know but don't forget gentlemen's gentlemen gentlemen rules you know so these are going to be closed because uh, those are closed wickets these are going to be open and these are going to be open anyway okay so i'm going to start building my first uh few things my, my first thing i need to do some pathing first uh i might use some bone blocks for the pave the new payment that I'm going to be adding in here as for an example because these these things are uh, directional you know so these are the entrance paths a few seconds here there you go I feel a bit like a uh, tinfoil chef right now uh, <laughs> tinfoil chef I clean everything slowly and calmly and I, I'm going to do that to everyone and right after this, it's going to be the theme park that, that you'll see with time. So this video is starting to be a bit long, filmed over a few days. Uh, I had kind of a dream saying, if you build it, they will come or it will come or something like that. So I, and, and in real life, in I, IRL, that, like everybody says, I saw this eye, so I built it, and nobody came. Might be in game though, so yeah. Let me know in the in, in the, the in the comments how you like it. Oh, I kind of made a small boo boo here. Should put that one one over there. Anyway, so in the comments, let me know if you like it. If you don't, it's okay, guys. Uh, everybody has their own uh, opinions. And 
like always don't forget guys like and subscribe if you want to see more of these types of videos this is going to be a lot bigger than right now i have a lot of land i have a, and i have a lot of ideals to build and at the same time don't forget guys if you drink don't drive because i want to see you here next time healthy and alive and the guys and the guys again and the guys my god my language is getting bad and again guys <laughs> don't forget guys we all love you. Ciao.